Я добре навчалася в школі, мені подобалося вчитися, мені подобався сам процес навчання, тому навіть коли я хворіла, не відвідувала заняття, мені було дуже цікаво читати. А у старшій школі я знав вже англійську мову дуже ну, непогано, тому що я почав готуватись до ЗНО. І я почався займатися у школі постійно, з репетитором почав займатися, і тому трошки підтягнув до середнього рівня такого непоганого. Hi everyone, welcome back. Hello, our dear guests. Всім привіт. Дуже рада сьогодні знову бути з вами. Добрий день, наші гості. My name is Elena. I am an English teacher and we have an English lesson in year 5. Отже, у нас урок англійської в 5 класі. So, the first job for you uh, is to look at the pictures. Yeah, and you can see those speech bubbles. You have the same speech bubbles on your tables. Can you think of what these people can say? What are they thinking about? So you can just write down uh, what they can say, yeah, and then you will share it with us. So if you look at that girl, for example, she's looking at her wardrobe and probably she's thinking of what she might wear today, right? And what about that man? He feels really hot. Поки наші гості пишуть, ви також можете це робити разом із нами. Подумайте, про що ці люди могли б думати в даний момент. Подивіться на малюночки і напишіть е, ті репліки, які вони могли б говорити. Are you ready to share? Yes. Good. Алевтина, what can you share with us? So what about that girl, for example? What should I wear? Fantastic. Yeah. So she is thinking about the weather probably. Yeah. And she is trying to pick up something from her wardrobe. Yeah. Good. And what about the man? Alek. Uh, I write, I'm so tired and hot. And hot. Exactly. We can see the sun and we can tell that it's boiling hot. It's so hot outside. Yeah. So probably the man is dreaming about some cold lemonade or some cold water and he is very hot. Okay. And what about the last one? What do you think? Is she hot? Freezy, freezy. <laughs> Freezing freezy. cold. Yeah. She's very cold, I guess. So let's see what I have. What's the weather like today? What am I wearing? So the girl is, is thinking about what she can wear today, yeah? And she is thinking about the weather outside. And if we look at that picture, what is he saying? It's boiling hot today. I need some cold water. Okay, and can you read the last one for me? See? Yeah, what a boiling hot day, weather. Yeah, fantastic. Can you read the last one? I am freezing, it's so cold outside. Yeah, really good. So I remember you told me that you remember those words, right? Boiling hot, дуже спекотно, freezing cold, дуже дуже холодно. Чудово. Now, um, there is a little text and some words are missing, right? But instead of the words, we have little pictures and that's a good activity for us to revise the weather and the weather vocabulary, right? So first of all, we will write the topic. What is the topic today? Weather, Weather and? Uh, Clothes. 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 Yes. Exactly. So it's weather. Uh, we need right. Uh, no, like no. It, it's just like the same in you, yeah? <laughs> uh, that's fine. If you want, you can write it down. Okay. Yeah, if you don't want, that's <laughs> fine. It is for our audience to understand what we are going to talk about, yeah? Okay, so that's. Weather and clothes. Pohoda ta odjah. Okay, so once you're ready, just let me know. We are going to read the text together. So what I want you to do is to revise the vocabulary. Try to think very hard and instead of those pictures, you should say the words, okay? So, um, what if you read, okay? I don't want to do your job, so you can read. Uh, me? Yeah, you can okay. start. Uh, the summer is the season 
with the best weather in Britain. Mm -hmm. It's hot and sunny uh, with only a little rain sometimes. However, it can sometimes be uh, cold. That one is hot, yeah, and this one is cold. Uh, and, and raining. Коли дуже волога погода. Wet. Good. For one or two weeks at a time. Okay, let's stop here. Alek, will you continue, please? Uh, British, British people like to spend a lot of time outside when the weather is warm. It autumn the weather gets colder and the stronger uh, blue winds. Uh, winds. Yeah, the wind blows or <laughs> the weather is it's windy nice and <laughs> there are yeah, it's good. Excuse me. <laughs> also it will raining. Rain it is raining. More. It mm -hmm. will be raining more. It's it is cold. Okay. Alexina, will you please finish? Uh, winter is the coldest season. In the UK it doesn't snow much. Mm -hmm. It's always nice when the spring starts its shine. And it is sunny. Uh, it's sunny, oh sorry. <laughs> and uh, it means uh, the nice weather in the summer is nearly back again. Back again. Good, so you know all the words. You're excellent students, Amazing. well done. <laughs> Окей, so once again, коли в нас гарне сонечко, яка це погода? Сонячна. Сонячна, sunny. Sunny. Коли накрапає дощик? It is raining. Yeah, it rains or it is raining at the moment. Коли ми бачимо термометр червоний, що це означає? Hot. Hot, спекотно. Коли в нас холодно, це називається? Cold. Cold. Волога погода? Wet. Wet after the rain, yeah? Вітер? Blows. Uh, wind, uh, wind blows, but uh, uh, wind, wind. wind. Yeah. Uh, dosh, again, rain, uh, snow, how do we call it? Snow, of course, uh, and sunny again. Okay, once more the seasons. Lito, it's summer. Summer. summer, summer, winter, winter. winter. Autumn. Autumn. autumn, and весна? spring. Fantastic, okay. Amazing. Uh -huh. You cannot see it clearly, I don't know why, but it says there is no such thing as bad weather, it's just a bad choice of clothes. What does it mean? I can say Alec, you can I tell can us, translate. You, can, you can translate, translate if you want, yeah, or you can describe uh -huh. it somehow, explain it somehow, it's up to you. If I, if I need to uh, translate, I can... Do it's it. up to you. You can use English or Ukrainian, so uh -huh. you can... Okay use your own words just to explain that, or you can translate, it's up to you. You okay. will help our audience uh, to understand. Okay. Um, I think, but I think, uh, in my opinion, bad weather is uh, raining. It is raining. Mm -hmm. uh, but if you have a very nice raincoat, there is no bad weather, right? Yes, yes. Тобто нема поганої погоди, є поганий вибір одягу, так? Тобто навіть якщо погода погана і дощова, наприклад, але якщо в нас дуже гарна парасолька або дуже гарне пальто або плащ, так? Ну, поганої погоди не існує. So that's um, what it means here, that there is no bad weather, but there is just bad choice of clothes. Good. And it's time to learn some vocabulary or to revise some vocabulary, because I can see that you know a lot, yeah? Uh, so you can see a lot of pictures and we have the word bank. Um, Alevtina, can you please read the words? Yes, of course. <laughs> Jeans, t-shirts, mittens, gloves, cap, socks, tights, hoodie, hat, dress, coat, raincoat, uh, fur coat, jacket, wellies, boots, uh, shirts, sneakers, trainers, gloves, uh, swimsuits, swimming trunks, uh, pullover, sweater, and shoes. And shoes. Do you know all the words? Uh, what does mean mittens? Mittens – це рукавички, ті, які дуже теплі. So, we usually wear mittens in winter, and we wear gloves in autumn or spring. Uh -huh. Тобто, gloves – це ті рукавички, які uh, малюночок справа знизу, які не такі теплі, and mittens – uh, it's a dusha tepler, very warm mittens. We usually wear them in winter. Yeah. Uh, do you know what wellies mean? Uh, yeah, yeah. What is different between? Uh, повне слово Wellington boots. Це означає резинові чоботи, так? And they're called wellies. So you can say either boots, чоботи, або wellies, гумові чоботи, так? Wellington boots. Добре. Що таке fur coat? Uh, це шуба. Шуба. Uh, що таке просто coat? 
пальто, рейнкоут. Дощове. Дослівно дощове, дощове пальто. Тобто це плащ, який захищає нас від води, від дощу. Так? А, що таке тайц? Girls should know that. Пантьохи, так, правильно. Сокс. Шкарпетки. Худі. Everyone knows that. Yeah, it's impossible to live without a hoodie. Yeah. Okay, jacket. Куртка. Куртка або піджак, легенька курточка. Так. Sneakers or trainers. Кросівки. Кросівки. Swimsuit and swimming trunks. And what is the difference? Купальник і плавки. І плавки. Yeah. So boys wear swimming trunks and the ladies wear swimsuits, right? Pullover sweater. I think it's clear. Yeah. Hat. Where do we put a hat? On the head. On the head. <laughs> Good. T-shirt. Uh, football. Football. Okay. Now we will check whether we were right or not. Yeah. So you can see the words, you can see the pictures, and they match, forming word friends in Paris. Yeah. So these are tights, panchochi, dress, suknya, valise, choboty, pullover or sweater, uh, sweater, swimsuit, swimming trunks, shoes. Так, uh, jacket, sneakers, trainers, just once more for our children to revise the words, right? Uh, flip-flops, what's that, by the way? Uh, тапочки. <laughs> так, в'єтнамки, те, що ми називаємо, так? Добре, mittens, бачите, це ті рукавички, які дуже теплі для зими. T-shirt, футболка, jeans, зрозуміло, shorts, almost the same as shorty, так, зрозуміло, що це? Gloves are those that we usually wear in autumn and spring, which are not very warm. Yeah? Hat. And by the way, we can have many different types of hats. Yeah? We can wear a summer hat or an autumn hat or a winter hat, which is very warm. Yeah? So the word is just hat, but we can use uh, this word in different contexts. Yeah? Um, raincoat, right? a yellow one. Plush, cap, um, cartoons. Okay. So I hope you remember the words, and now it is time to have a little practice, yeah? Um, I have Lego blocks, and I think everyone likes doing that, or you used to like it when you were smaller, younger, yeah? So I have four main cubes that says spring, right? Autumn, осень, ми вже пам'ятаємо, знаємо, summer, літо, and Winter, Zima. So what you have to do, I will give you the cubes, they all have the words. Uh, there are different pieces of clothes on different blocks. So you will have, for example, you will have winter and autumn and you will have spring and summer. All you have to do is to put these cubes on top of the seasons and then you will tell us why you decided to choose these or that piece of clothes. Clear? Yeah. Okay. okay. So you have your Lego blocks and you have the seasons and we have to pick up the clothes that we can wear either in winter or in summer or in spring or in what is left, autumn, yeah? And also, while telling me about the clothes, you can use the phrases. When it's cold, for example, in winter, I put on my and you pick up something and you tell me what you usually put on. Okay, so we, we are going to do that one by one. So you can just randomly pick up one piece of Lego and you can put it somewhere and then you will tell me where. Okay, Alexina, well done. So you have autumn. Mm -hmm. Can you use the phrase? When it's autumn, mm -hmm. I put on sweater. I put my sweater on. on. Uh, because it's cold. <laughs> yeah, and you want to feel warm and cozy and nice. Good. Alek? Um, when... When it's hot, mm -hmm. I put I don't I put on my summer dress. I put my summer <laughs> dress on. Mm, yes. Interesting. I would love to see that. <laughs> okay, good. When it's spring, I put my raincoat on because because it uh, can rain. Yeah, it rains a lot, and yes. your raincoat will protect you from the rain. Good. Uh, when it snows, I put on my winter boots. I put my winter boots on. Because it will be wet. It will but be wet, 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 it will wet, be wet. cold, and yes. your winter boots will yeah. protect you from this awful cold weather. Good. 
Alif Dina, what do you have? Uh, when it's spring, I put on my scarf because it's not warm enough and I can uh, be cold without Very a scarf. Very well, it's not warm enough. Дуже гарна фраза, недостатньо тепло. It's not warm enough. That's why you might need your scarf to protect your neck. Yeah? Дуже добре. Олег, what do you have? Um, when it's hot, mm -hmm. I put on my shirt and mm -hmm. shirts because uh, I want to go with my friends to the beach. Mm -hmm. Good, and you want to look smart, yeah? So you yeah. put shorts because it's hot, <laughs> but you put your shirt on to look smart, yeah? Yes. Good. Okay. Uh, when it's spring, I often put on my wellies mm -hmm. uh, not to get my legs wet. Wet, exactly. Very good. Excuse me, I forgot uh, what is the mean um, swimsuit and gloves. And gloves. Swimsuit is a kupalnik. Uh -huh. Swimming trunks is for chlopchikov, swimsuit is for the uh, A gloves is for the hands. Those that we wear in the spring and the summer. Not mittens, those that are very hot. But those that we wear in the spring and the summer. Okay, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Okay. Um, can I? Alek, of course. When it's uh, frost, uh, when it's rain. Um, when it rains. Mm -hmm. When it, when it rains, maybe a little a little bit snows. Mm -hmm. I put uh, I put on my fur coat. I put my fur coat on. Yeah, it's very warm, and you will feel very cozy and very warm wearing your fur coat. Yeah. Fur coat, sir. Uh, Шуба. Так, дуже-дуже тепла. Fur coat. Окей. Why not? Men also wear fur coats. I hope it's not natural one. Of course not. Okay. We are eco-friendly, so we have to keep that in mind, of course. When it's cold outside, I wear my coat. Yeah, to feel, to feel warm, of course, you yeah. will not go outside without your coat in winter or in autumn. Yeah, of course. Okay, anything else? I, I, I've taken gloves mm -hmm. uh, because I often need gloves uh, while uh, cold weather to make uh, my hands warm and mm -hmm. to make nice pictures. <laughs> of course. Yeah. yeah. Very good. Okay, so I think we've done with it. Yeah? And that's the phrase we normally use. I put on my something when it's something. Yeah, talking about weather. For example, when it's cold, I put on my hat. Good. Okay, now we'll practice a little bit more. We'll, we'll work with the words. And we have a little game which is called Who Has I Have? Do you know the game? Yeah, it's very easy. I have a set of different cards. Yeah. And all we have to do, we'll be asking who has, and we'll be answering I have. Who has a hat, for example, and you have to check on your cards. If you have a picture, you say I have a hat, yeah? And you ask the question. Okay, so I will leave some cards for myself. I will play with you, and you will have some cards too. So the first job is to find the first card, yeah? So can you look through if you have the first one? I start? have the first card. Good. Okay. Alitina, can you start then if you have the first card? What does yes. it say? Uh, I have the first card. Who has valleys? Valleys. Що таке valleys? Рукавички теплі. Чоботи. А, чоботи. Так, шукаємо розинові. Так, у кого є? I have valleys. Good. Who has raincoat? Who has raincoat? Oh, I have a raincoat who has flip-flops I have flip-flops who has winter coat winter coat maybe I have winter coat it should be very warm yeah mm -hmm. what uh, does it say who has jeans I have jeans here is it okay uh, who has summer dress who has summer dress? I have summer dress who has hoodie? Hoodie? Hoodie, I don't. Who I have hoodie. Good. Who has t-shirt? I have t-shirt. 
And who has swimsuit? I have swimsuit. Mm -hmm. Who has shirts? I don't have any. <laughs> I, I have shirts. Uh, who has uh, sneakers? Sneakers, I do. I have sneakers. Who has pullover? I have a pullover. Who has, what does it say? Shoes. Oh, that's me again. I'm lucky again. I have shoes. Who has winter hat? Do you have a winter hat? No, because I have. <laughs> <laughs> I have a winter hat. Who has the last card? I have the last card. Good. <laughs> Thank you. Well done. Okay, let's do it very, very quickly. We are going to work with the words again. Yeah, so let's just read the sentences and all you have to do is to pick up a right answer, a right option. So let's do it very fast, okay? okay. Alek, you can start. With jeans you can wear sh uh, shirts. A shirt. Shirt. Of course. A shirt. Okay, Alexina. Uh, over a dress, you can put on uh, a coat. A coat, over a dress. Mm -hmm. When it's cold, you wear a jacket. Good. When it's warm, you wear a t-shirt. A t-shirt, of course. Boys often wear a tracksuit. Tracksuit, yeah. Only girls wear uh, skirts. Mm -hmm. You can put a cap, cap on your head. Cap, of course, on your head. On the beach, you wear uh, swimming trunks. Swimming trunks. Well done. Good. Now let's do this one very quickly. So, uh, I will read you the first one. It's hot and sunny. I'm going to go out to play with my friends. And you have to find a match. So what can you wear to go out with the friends when it's hot? I'm going to put my old white t-shirt and blue shorts on. So when we are thinking of what to wear, we can use I'm going to wear, I'm going to put on. Okay, so let's do that. Alimtina, the second one. Uh, it's cool. I'm going to go to the shop. I'm going to put on my blue sweater and grey trousers on. Yeah, why not? Okay, Alek, the third one. It's a dancing party today. I'm going to put on my beautiful pink dress and shoes on. See? Okay, good. Uh, number four. Uh, it's raining. I'm going to go to school and uh, I'm going to... Uh, put on my coat, red cap, scarf and mittens on. Mm -hmm. And the last one, Alek, please. It's now when go to the park. Uh, I'm going to put on my coat, red cap, scarf and mittens on. It's okay. not right. Yeah, we will check now. That's fine. Uh, it's up to you. Yes, some will put, some people will put a coat on without any mittens or scarf or socks. Yeah, and someone else will put a winter coat and a hat or maybe two hats even. Yeah. So I thought it would be like that, yeah? So it's snowing, then you can put on your coat, red cap, scarf, mittens, everything that you have in your home, yeah? And when it's raining, for example, you're going to put your yellow raincoat and green boots. Of course, if you go to the party, you will put a beautiful dress on, right? And when it's cool and you're going to the shop, you can wear a uh, blue sweater and gray trousers. Very good, okay. Now, just a very quick revision of present simple, present continuous, past simple. It's very simple because past simple, we use to talk about the past, that's obvious, and present simple, present continuous, we use to talk about the present. But present simple, we talk about the things in general, те, що постійно відбувається, правильно, рутинні речі. Present continuous, we need to talk about the things happening at the moment. Так? Тому, коли ми говоримо зараз я вдягнена у щось, там ми говоримо I'm wearing something. Yeah? For example, вчора я була вдягнена у щось, I wore something yesterday. Так? Тому що це неправильне дієслово, ми його шукаємо в табличці. Правильно? I wore something. І якщо я зазвичай щось одягаю, ми говоримо I wear. I usually wear trousers to work, for example. Якщо ми говоримо про когось, тобто третя особа однини, наприклад, he, she, ми додаємо закінчення s. He wears, he usually wears something to work. Так? Зараз будемо разом це робити. Так, секундочку, щось пішло не так. 
Uh -huh. Okay, um, so let's read first and after that we'll do the task, okay? Can we quickly read this little story about the girl who was trying to pick up the best clothes? Alitinchka, can you start please? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, Jasmine always take, uh, gets up at 7 o'clock. Uh, she quickly gets up. She's in a hurry so she doesn't brush her teeth. She doesn't even comb her hair. She opens a wardrobe and quickly puts on her favorite pink t-shirt and a skirt. At last, she's uh, at last she's ready, so she takes her school bag and opens the front door. But there is a surprise. Oh no, it's raining and it's cold. I must go back and change my clothes. Okay, let's stop here. I think everything is obvious. Yeah, the girl spent a lot of time looking for what to wear and she wanted to wear her beautiful pink t-shirt. But then... Um, she realized that it was raining. Uh, she opens, she gets up, she does everything. That present simple. Uh, it's raining. It is raining. Alek, will you finish the text? So she goes back and puts on warm sweater and jeans, but she can't find her umbrella. Now I'm really, really late. Finally, she finds her umbrella and rushes to school. She run, ay, rushes, okay. Mm -hmm. Rushes, pospishaya duže do školy, rushes. She is very late already. Mm -hmm. She runs into Tom, but Tom is not a hurry at all. Her, hello, Jasmine. Hi, Tom, hurry up, we are late for school. Tom looks at her in surprise. School? But today it's Sunday. Another surprise for her, yeah? Mm -hmm. Oh dear, there is no school today. Great, then I can finish reading Harry Potter. She goes back home to enjoy her favorite day of the week. Of the week, yeah. Okay, and finally we're going to do this little exercise and you will be using the hands. Отже, я буду читати, або ви будете читати і показувати правильну ручку із словом, яке треба вставити. Добре? Давайте. Олег. I can start. It's rainy wet. And cold, I am, I am wearing. I am wearing. Mm -hmm. I am wearing my wearers a raincoat and I have an umbrella. Umbrella, parasolka, чудово. Uh, it's freezing cold. He is uh, wearing a uh -huh. winter hat. Good, uh, Sherry winter... is caring. <laughs> he uh, is winter wearing. coat and a pair of winter boots. Чудово. Так. Yesterday the weather was sunny and calm. I wore a pair of jeans and a t-shirt to, to go outside. Wore minuli chas. Chudovo. You are a super team. You work together fantastically. Dream team. The next one. Yeah, dream team. Exactly. He always uh, wears... Wears uh, with the end in S. Yes. Good. Uh, well is when it's wet outside. Chudovo. The next one. Uh, we are wearing summer dresses today as the weather is hot and sunny. You're so clever. You know everything. Good. <laughs> number six. Um, number six. I usually wear mm -hmm. a scarf in autumn when it's windy and rainy. Good. I am wearing my sandals now it's as it is hot. Not hot. Mm -hmm. Yes, and the last one? Um, he wore a coat yesterday because it's cold. That's it for today. Thank you so much for your great job. You're excellent students. And thank you so much for your attention. That's the end of the lesson. See you soon. Bye. Bye. Чесно кажучи, дуже вдалий досвід, тому що є деякі слова, які я зміг згадати, є деякі слова, які я зміг вивчити для себе, тому що, як виявилось, я не все знаю. І тому можу сказати, що це було дуже продуктивне заняття. Це був такий флешбек у часи мого школярства. І я згадала з посмішкою, як було цікаво вчитися насправді. Мені варто було більше цінувати той час і не квапитися виростати, бо школа це прикольно. І було дуже інтерактивно, мені сподобалось.